Hello, it's our Wednesday devotion. And God said, I will be with you, and this will be a sign to you, that it is I who have sent you. When you have brought the people out of Egypt, you'll worship God on this mountain. From Exodus 3 verse 12. You see, Moses had fled, fled Egypt where he grew up because he was caught killing a man. After his time in exile away in Midian, he came upon a burning bush and God calls to Moses from that bush. He tells Moses he is sending him back to Egypt to bring the people of Israel out of Egypt and to set them free. Now Moses responds, Who am I? Who am I that I should go to Pharaoh and bring the, the Israelite people out of Egypt? Who am I that I should do this? Who am I that I should go and, and do this task? Who am I, God, that you're calling for this job? Maybe not out loud, but maybe you've said that. Maybe you've wondered that. Maybe you've said to God, who am I, God? Who am I that you've called to lead this Bible study, to preach your word, to engage with people in our community, to, to share a testimony? Who am I, God, that you've called me to, to love my neighbour, to care for people who are far from Jesus? And to show them your way. I think we can all relate to this at times. We feel what God is asking is too hard. It's too much. You've got the wrong person. He's made a mistake. We can't do it. But the truth about these feelings is that it isn't about how we feel or how qualified we are or aren't. Instead, it's all about who is with us and who our God is. That's how God responds to Moses. He says, I will be with you. And that is the word for us today. That is the encouraging words we need to hear. I'll be with you. Whatever the call, whatever the task, whatever the place God is sending and using us, He is with us. It's amazing that God says, I'll be with you. And the sign of this will be revealed to you after you obey me. I think sometimes God wants us to obey without having any proof. Sometimes he calls us to step out, even if we can't see where we're going. God says, I am who I am. Moses, I am who I am. Moses asks, who am I? That I should go to Pharaoh. And God's promise is, I am who I am. I am God, and I will be with you. Let this exchange challenge us today. For God is calling each of us to step out, to have faith, to obey, to move on to that next thing. We should all consider, hey God, who am I? But more importantly, hey God, who are you? You are the God who is with us. You are the God who doesn't let us down. It is not about who you are. Instead, it's all about who God is. So today, 
this week. Think about what God is calling you to do. What he is asking. Even if you feel unqualified. Even if you feel you can't do it. But trust in him. Take a step. See God's provision. See his hand at work. Where is God asking you to take a step of faith now? Are there ways, are there places that God wants you to step up and to step out to? Follow his call. Follow his leading. Follow the prompting of the Holy Spirit. Remember, it's more about him. It's more about him at work in us. At work in us. Who are we? We are the people that God has called. We are the people that God has empowered. So let us take a step and God will meet us there. God bless you. Amen.